Hello friends, welcome to this session of learning R programming and data visualization using ggplot2. In this session, we are going to learn how to customize legend of our plot. In this session, we are going to learn how to position the legend and how to change or modify the legend. Let's start learning and uh, this is the plot which I have plotted as the base plot and here you can see the plot has a title, subtitle is also there then legend is also there this legend by default we get it by default we have not specified anything for this legend because we have mapped the petal length and sepal length to this axis and we have got these points using the geom point labels are added using this labs uh, layer to the ggplot and all this appearance is by default this is theme gray the background of this uh, legend key is background of the plot also is defined by the theme gray and that the predefined theme and it is used as default uh, theme gray this theme is there and when we run that you can see the same plot now we will change that to classic because i like classic theme and i will build on this theme now will start playing with the legend if you want to play with this theme theme just type theme there put a question mark in front of this theme and run that line you will get help in r and all these theme elements are there you can play with this uh, this is the details of these arguments line argument rectangle argument text argument is there and for all the visual aspects visual elements of the plot uh, the theme arguments are there you can play with this theme and many examples are also provided you can copy these examples and you can run these examples in script window or in console and you can play with this to learn more okay we'll start playing and i open the plot now i'll add a layer theme there theme and when i click theme in this function uh, i'll have to this in this session i am going to uh, demonstrate how to play with the legend how to customize the legend therefore i will put legend there and you will get a drop down list of all the legend arguments and you can play with that first we'll play with the legend background and mostly we play very rarely with the legend background but this will give a demonstration of how to uh, customize the legend element rectangle we are going to use because i am going to fill this rectangle with uh, some color fill is equal to and the color name that shall be in inverted code gray 60 and uh, this uh, theme uh, legend background uh, entire uh, got the gray color if you just want to change the uh, that legend key background only that legend key argument is there and there also that element rectangle fill gray 60 is there when we run that you can see that only the key has got the background we rarely play with this i will remove this code and now we will play with legend key key size all these arguments are there legend text is there we'll uh, try with this and this is element text you have to play with the specific element which is allowed to that specific visual aspect that there many different elements are there which we will see again but here i will play with the color color is equal to uh, in inverted quote again red we will run that one more bracket is there i removed the bracket i will run that uh, now here color of the legend got changed okay, legend key got changed if you want to play with legend title that full comma shall be there legend dot title again it's a element text element text i'll put color is equal to again red if you want to change the size i will just bring that to new line so that it is visible i'll put comma after this argument comma then legend dot title is equal to 
element this different elements are there and this element text is a suitable element here and size is equal to 4 we'll run that and legend title matched by multiple actual arguments okay this i will remove from here i will add to the this one only size is equal to 8 this time and we'll see what happens it is smaller one and i will make it 18 more conspicuous okay, all the text elements we can uh, legend title related to all that we can play in this uh, argument only we don't have to get the multiple arguments otherwise we'll get the error there uh, that face i want it to be bold and run that this face is bold now we'll play with the position of the legend okay. we'll come there legend dot position is equal to okay. many different arguments are uh, options are there one is the top this right is by default we'll place it in the top when we run that legend is there on the top and this direction is got defined this direction is horizontal earlier it was vertical now it is horizontal we can change that direction also that legend dot direction is equal to in bracket we can put horizontal and run that it's horizontal by default we'll put that vertical vertical and run that this is vertical argument as per your requirement to make your plot uh, good to look at you can play with these elements this vertical spacing doesn't look good now we will change that to right left right is by default left and run that legend is there on left we can take that legend to bottom also and for top and bottom default direction is horizontal we have specified that uh, default direction is vertical we have specified it as vertical no for top and bottom a legend is horizontal default direction and we have specified a vertical we'll make that again horizontal and we'll see that this horizontal legend is there and we can do many things with the legend just start practicing how to customize the legend you can play with all other elements also i will uh, one by one will go on adding the videos to show you how to play with the different uh, theme elements to customize your plot for our requirement and one video also i will make to show you how to define your own theme which will be your signature as i said in the uh, previous session okay. thanks for watching this video if you like this video please click the like button subscribe this my channel if you are not subscribed yet and share these videos with your friends if they require to draw beautiful plots thanks thanks for watching this video